Hello and welcome to this video. In this video, I will show you how to download and install a package. For this video, I will show you how to install R package called R Commander. So for that, I have already started R and this window shows R console and on R console, you will see a short description of the version and other things. And at the bottom of that text, you will see a greater than sign in our language. It is called the prompt sign. So it prompts you to type something. I will type only two sentences, one for installing the package, another for loading the package. So the first sentence is install. Okay, I will type install, install dot packages. And then open parentheses, open double quote, type uppercase R, C M D R will be lowercase, and then close double quote and close parentheses, and then hit enter. So once you hit enter, it will give you the option of choosing the CRAN mirrors. I will choose the CRAN mirror from Texas, USA, Texas, and click OK. So it will take less than one minute or a couple of seconds you see it is very fast and depending on your internet speed it will be faster or slower so you will type here at the end of the prompt sign you will type another sentence which is library so in order to load the package you have to say you have to type library open parentheses uppercase r c m d r lowercase and close parentheses remember this time you may or may not type double quotes um, around our commander so once i type that i will click on enter or i will hit enter and it will show the next window that is the r commander package in r commander package there are drop down menus for example you can click on file and see what different options are available edit you can see what different options are available data we will use several of these options from within data like in order to create new data set you will click on new data set if you want to load our data set then you will click on load data set if you want to import a file for example from other software packages like spss or sas minitab stata uh, you can use this we will use mainly this option for importing data from Excel file. There will be a separate video to show how to import uh, data from Excel file into our commander. And statistics menu gives you several options. You can choose some of these. Then graphs option gives you the options of choosing histogram, box plot, scatter plot, line graph, bar graph pie chart etc uh, you can see none of these are highlighted right now because we don't have a data file loaded so in uh, this video i will show you how to load data file into our commander so for that we will go to data and click on data in packages so we start with data in packages and if you want to see what data are available in packages, you can click on list data sets in packages. So once I click here, I will see different types of R data sets. And these R data sets can be used in statistical uh, learning within R environment or within R commander. So I will, I will, um, show you what data files are available in the package called car so for that i will go back to our commander and every time you um, click on a data file or something uh, in the in the r commander it will automatically put down the r commander in the desktop so you have to grab it back from the desktop i will go to data again and click on data in packages and then read data set from an attached package so i will do that and click on r sorry click on car c a r and then i will click on bowman data and once i click on bowman data it will be selected here so i will click on ok in order to see 
that the Bowman data file is loaded. So once Bowman data file is loaded, I can view this data set. So click on view data set in order to see how the data looks like. It has uh, three groups. You can see here group is the first variable. It has basal as one group, DRTA is another group, and the third group is strat. In order to see what these groups mean, you can see a help menu on R Commander, and I will show you that in the next video. Thank you for watching.